Hello, this is my 10th tutorial in 3 d Rad, and today I'm going to show you how to make a multiplayer game for a car, with cars. So first to start with, add a car, I mean first train. Yeah, just wait. Okay, then after add a car. Okay, then related to the terrain. Now add a cam chase. Like this. Okay. And now they're gonna have to be some modifications to the cam chase. So related to the car. And now make the width and the height zero point five. And actually width has to be one and height has to be zero and a half. Like this, okay? Now once you've done that, just make it um like put it anywhere. Now I'm gonna see how close that's okay, so it's half the screen. So now that's actually a good um that's actually good. So now after add a G force. Relate to the relate the G force to the car. And now add another car. Just put it anywhere else. This is for the second player. Okay. And once you've done that, then click on another cam chase. Like this. Put it anywhere also. Okay, so once you've done that, now you're gonna have to modify the cam chase, but first relate to the car and relate this car to the G Force. So the G Force is related to both of those cars. So now the cam chase, make the vertical position vertical position zero and a half and make the height zero point five. Now it's gonna have a double window. Like this, gonna be two. Now make sure that the car is also related to the terrain. So now you get two cars like this. But the problem is that both cars go together. So you're gonna have to make that um, the the second car have different controls. So I'm gonna make it um, S Z. I mean, X, and then the left will be Z, and C. There is no W, A, S, D, as usual games, but, um, but I, but this is the second best that you can do, so, um, I chose that one. So now, I'm gonna try it right now. Okay, so now, theoretically, my first car should only move, and then when I click on the second one, then the second one should move also. Now I'm gonna modify my cam chase. Zero point nine nine seven as usual. So I usually do all the time in my tutorials. So um now should be better. So now my first car will move and the second car will move. Yep. Just as I predicted. Now, to just to, um, to make the cars collide, relate to the car to the car to the car. I mean, to the other car. So then you'll get this. A perfect multiplayer game. And then, once you I'm gonna collide the car, just um, to see if it works. Yeah, it works. Now, um, 
this is your multiplayer game and um that's it for this tutorial so um hope you like it bye